Okay. Hi friends. This is Travelika from Air Crew Aviation's Private Limited. Today, I'm here to talk a few points about how to write a cabin crew resume for freshers and experienced. A cabin crew CV isn't much different than writing a CV for any other job, but that probably doesn't make the thought of creating a CV for your cabin crew application any less daunting. Airline recruiters receive thousands of applications every time they do a cabin crew recruitment drive. Follow this step-by-step -step guide. This method has been tried, tested, and is proven to work time and time again. The step-by-step -step guide to create your perfect resume. The step one is collate your details. Start by collating all the borrowing information that will be needed for your cabin tree CV. Sometimes we can be tempted to guess or provide the rough date we finish a job or graduated from school. The details you include on your CV will differ based on your pers personal circumstances. For example, if you have more than 10 years of work experience, you won't need to include what grades you got at high school. Education, name of all places of education, example high school, college, university, etc. Finish date, that is month and year, names and scores of all education certificates. And the next is employment and voluntary work. Name of the employee, title of the role, month and year of the start and end of the employment. The step two is format your CV. Now, it's time to start filling out these details onto your CV. You'll want a cabin tree CV that looks professional and present all the information in an easy to read format. You can find a lot of CV templates on the internet or in pop popular word processing software, but these aren't designed to work with the ADS software that airline recruiters use. If you would prefer to create your own CV from scratch, then there are a few simple rules that you need to follow. The thing is, don't be tempted by colorful and over-the-top CV designs. The computer can't read them properly and they won't impress the recruiters. Cabin to recruitment is a conservative business, so big, bold, and bright resumes are best left to media and creative industry. The next is, don't include the following on your CV. That is, your photo, date of birth, nationality, etc. The step three is, Learn the qualities that airlines are looking for. And here we come to what are the specific skills, qualities, and competences that airline recruiters are looking for. Time to research everything about the airlines you want to work for. You are you that need to carefully study the cabin tree job adverts. Think of them as a list of keywords to be included in your CV. If you write a single line that doesn't help to prove your possesses that qualities, ask yourself what that line is even doing in your CV. The step four is what style to write your CV in. This is a really confusing part of your resume. Writing that a lot of people get wrong. Follow the simple rules for a resume that the hiring manager will actually. First of all, write everything in the past tense. Eliminate all pronouns. I and my, for example, served customers and resolved problems quickly and efficiently, successfully managed the shop and staff. In the step five, describe your achievements. This is the main part where the interviewer gets attracted. Many people write a resume by simply listing their duties and responsibilities, but a resume that instead focuses on achievement can provide a compelling picture of the person you really are. Sometimes, when you do the same job day in, day out, it's easy to lose track of a small achievements you made. Where possible, use number to qualify your achievements. Step 6. Check and check again. By now, you should have a really good looking cabin to CV that highlights your best achievements. All your evidences is linked to a specific qualities that airline recruiters are looking for. But there's always room for improvement. Small mistakes are easily made, bad words creep in, and we occasionally lose focus. Reading and rereading your cabin crew CV is absolutely essential. And that's it. You have your perfect cabin crew CV. Please don't rush this process. It could take a couple of days or several weeks until you're happy with your CV. Thank you.